welcome guys. Yes, Kimmy Ruff and Adventures are out, aren't they, babe? <laughs> There's my little babe there on the her. 2017 fat boy low. Low, low, in the boat. It is low. <laughs> yes, and there's my beautiful Heritage 2018 classic. Now, this is the first trip in the boat. Long yes. trip, overnight trip for us on the Harleys. Never seen and done before. And look at the beautiful day at the moment, guys. Look at this. It is a mild, probably 10 degrees at the moment. Celsius that is, isn't it? I think. And we're rugged up to the hill at the moment because it is a winter's day. So let us proceed. As you can hear, those beautiful Reinhardt pipes on both bikes. <laughs> In the boat. Yep. Because mine's better. Of course it is. <laughs> Let's go. We are going down. To going the, down. Going down to the east coast of Tasmania. Today, which from our destination is mm, about 340 k's away, I think. So it's about what time is it, babe? About 9 30, quarter to 10 in the morning. Yeah, we waited for the sun to come up just a little bit before we leave because everyone knows in winter if the sun's out, it's a lot warmer in the boat. Certainly is. Yeah. So anyway, we'll proceed guys, and we'll catch you later on down the road a bit further. Okay, so that's a beautiful day in the bay. It is. Yes, and we're just passing through Burnley. Look at that ocean today, guys. We have beautiful views here along the northwest coast of Tasmania, don't we? You don't agree? I was talking to them, but I'm also talking to you. Okay. <laughs> yes, we do. <laughs> yeah. the sun glistening on the water. It is. It's beautiful, isn't it? But anyway, like I said when we left home, just before I left home, we have not been away overnight on these two bikes yet, as been both Harleys, have we? Nope. No, because of the COVID lockdowns and everything closing down, it's starting to open up. And work commitments, I hate to say it, but work commitments... Normally it's raining on the weekends, we've got off, isn't it? Yeah. So, it's supposed to be a beautiful weekend this weekend, albeit it's probably only going to get to about 13 degrees Celsius, 14 degrees, but if that eye in the sky is out, it will be good, won't it? Yeah. <laughs> well, it should be anyway. Maybe I could turn my electric vest off for a while. Yeah, old Wussy back there, she rides Harley, doesn't she? <laughs> oh, you can do <laughs> yeah, I'm going to have to stop saying that now, aren't I? Yes. Yes. But old Rusty, he ain't got no electric vest on. Look, Rusty's got fingerless gloves on. You see that, guys? <laughs> <laughs> yes. But anyway, we're going to mosey on up to those beautiful mountains over there. No snow on them, though, is there, babe? Bit of cloud, no snow. Yeah, bit of cloud. Cradle Mountain is back over the back there, guys, for all you that don't know. We can't see it at the moment, but... I don't think there's much snow up there anyway. But we're just about to pull into Elizabeth Town. As everyone knows, we always stop at ETC for a coffee, don't we? Yeah, we always plug it. We're, we're frequent, uh, we're, what are we, babe? Frequent shoppers. Frequent shoppers here, yeah, that's it. We've got a special little card, haven't we? We have. Oh, we must be up for a free one nearly, too. Free coffee, that is. Yeah, <laughs> she always wants a large, she's always disappointed. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm not prepared to pay that much. <laughs> Enough of the frivolity, babe. Yeah, we're back to the coffee. I told you to keep this trip clean. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so we're coming up to ET ETC. We're going to call in here. We don't have to refill yet. I don't know how this audio is going to be because I haven't actually tested it on the bike with the Harley with the exhaust so I'm hoping it'll be okay because it's a total new setup helmet, bike, everything compared to what we're used to with the V-Strom when I'm filming So we'll go up here because we got special parking haven't we babe? I don't know why they didn't park in there Don't know might have been a heap of bikes in here. And we're going to go in for a drink. 
G'day guys, we're here, aren't we? We're, we're here. at Elizabeth Town and we've just had a lovely cup of coffee, haven't we? Mm -hmm. As you can see, it's beautiful here. There's the bikes right there. That's young Kimmy there, isn't it, Kimmy? Kimmy's all rugged up today, aren't you? I am. <laughs> <laughs> but look at that beautiful view over there, guys. Look, I'll just take you for a little walk. This is at the ETC Cafe in Elizabeth Town. Look at that. Beautiful. Yeah, there's a chook over there hiding from Kim. Kim won't give you nothing to eat. Look, there he is, right there. Chook, 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 chook. See, there he is. He's been here. He's been here the last couple of times we've been here. I think he comes out the greeters, doesn't he, Bo? He used to have a friend and they lived over there. I used to call Kim the chook on the Harley. Anyway, guys, we're going to mosey on on. Next stop is Perth in Tasmania, not Western Australia. We've got to put some fuel in before we head down towards the East Coast, don't we? So we'll catch you on the road, guys. Okay, then. So we've got to change the plan, haven't we, babe? Changing the plan. Yeah, we just come around Perth. We're not stopping at Perth, Tasmania, that is. We're going to stop at Canoa Junction, and we're going to put petrol in there, aren't we? Well, that didn't matter. They've got a bypass there at Perth now. We went on the bypass instead. And um, we'll just stop at Canara Junction, which is about 20k's down the road, 25k's down the road, something like that. Okay, guys, so we're coming into Epping Forest, which is Canara Junction, just up the road. We're going to stop here, get some fuel. And a bit of fuel for the body too, probably. What do you reckon? Yeah. Yeah. Are you hungry? Yep. I bet she bet you anything she wants to go to the toilet. I do. Yeah, see, there you go guys. Cause I'm old. Of course she's old. So we'll go in here. Where have we got 95? 98 we got. Mmm. Yeah. And we got 98 there, we got 98 down that end too. Don't know. I'll go through and have a look. No. Yes, we have. Come yeah, through, sure. Yep. Oh, I'm sure, of course, I'm sure. Uh, so you know what he ate. I wasn't going to back it up. <laughs> well, I'll put 98 in mine, put diesel in your tractor. <laughs> okay? Yeah, whatever. So we went inside here, had a bit of a break, a bit of a toilet stop, and a couple of sweet chilli chicken burgers, and they were very nice. Righto. So, where's Kimmy? Kimmy's gone. She's gone out of the vlog. She's gone, there she is over there. We're at Canara, well not Canara Junction, Epping Forest. And we've just had a couple of sweet chilli burgers, haven't we babe? And we are about to head down towards St Helens. And um, we just filled up there, right there. There's young Kimmy there. Got a full belly, haven't you babe? What? Yeah, look at that, she's soft isn't she? She's got hand warmers in there. Yep. But it is 8.9 degrees at the moment and a little bit overcast. No rain now, I don't think. So we will get going, won't we, babe? We will. Okay, catch you soon. Okay, so we're making our way down to the turn off. Down through the Fingal Valley, the Great Eastern Drive. And that will take us down through to St. Helens. Will it not, my dear? Yes, yeah, well, yes, we've got to end St Mary's, we've got a few small towns in between, haven't we? But we're going to head down this way, and this is quite a good road, this one. Yeah, I like it. Yeah. It's only 100. Yeah, it's only 100 k's, but it's a nice free-flowing road, this. It's a happy road. Yeah. <laughs> Until we get to St Mary's Pass, and then it gets a bit twisty, don't it, babe? Anyway, we'll catch you down there at St Mary's Pass, and that's about 75 kilometres away. Okay, so we're coming up to St Mary's Pass, aren't we, my dear? We are. And we're just going to pull in here for a sec, just before we start going through the St Mary's Pass. Right, we're at St Mary's Pass, aren't we? Where we are at the beginning of it. Yes, at the beginning of it. Now we're about to progress through there. It's. Are you still recording? Yes, you are. It's down through that way, St. Mary's Pass. And I tell you, be careful. Very. 
very windy in the bay. For six kilometres? For, no, about seven kilometres or something. Got switchbacks, trees, debris on the road at times, ice, rocks, gravel. A lot of caravans go through there, don't they? So they hit the side of it sometimes, bring it out onto the road. What else we got through? Animals. Trucks. Fucking Harley riders behind me as well. Yeah. You gotta watch them. And trucks, yes. So, you gotta be very, very careful. But in saying that, it's a great little pass, isn't it? Oh, it's lovely. We love it. It's very, <laughs> very dangerous. Is it? Because <laughs> <Very dangerous. laughs> yeah, you've got the maniacs coming across the, across the bloody centre line all the time. Yeah. As you guys know that ride bikes. Anyway, we'll hop on and away we'll go. Won't we? Yep. Catch you through the pass, guys. Okay, you ready? Hang on. Oh, you couldn't hear me going. Nah, not by the sound of my bike. Okay, so this is the start of it, guys. 60 k is my See? ass. Dead animals on the road. I told you guys. You gotta be careful down through here. A hell of a lot of rock slides and everything down through here. It often... It often gets um, closed during winter because of rock slides and flooding. You could have took that corner at 80. Who? Oh. Yeah. Why? Just because it says 60, you don't have to do 60. <laughs> could be a bit dangerous though. She crept on a bit back there, guys. She starts talking a lot when she gets nervous. <laughs> oh, big rock there. See? Dangerous. You can see all this wire netting and everything on the cliffs here. But you will often find the corners are wet still. It's pretty good here at the moment. It is a nice sunny day down here at the moment, isn't it, boat? Yeah. This is switchback. I remember the first time we brought Kim down through here on the bike. Well, she was very slow. I thought she was going to fall over the edge here. She was going that slow around them. <laughs> no, true story, wasn't it, babe? Oh, yeah. yeah. I was worried. <laughs> she was worried. That's a lot of years ago now, though. Yeah. That was on the boulevard. Yes, you were on the boulevard then when we first come down here, C50 Boulevard. You can see, so that's what she did there, them guide posts. <laughs> they still haven't fixed them. Nah. Uh, that's from actual semi-trailers that uh, come down around through here sometimes. They take them out when they're cutting the corners, especially when they're meeting traffic. Here's another one mm. right here. Look at that, right there on the edge there. Took it out. Took it out. And now you can see the east coast. You guys probably won't be able to see it. You can see the ocean as you come around that corner. I've progressed to third gear around these corners. What gear? Third. Yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah, well, I used to go around them in first. <laughs> yeah, that's what you used to fucking fall off nearly. Yeah. <laughs> Could that's you imagine, just... guys? <laughs> uh, that's it. Makes you feel like you need it to be longer. <laughs> Oh, it's a little bit longer yet. A couple more corners and that. It does go pretty quick, but it is nice, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Another switch back down the bottom here. It's better than the... It's a bit of a change to all the straight bits of road we've been on. Or sweeping roads. Yeah, guys, it only takes five, ten minutes to get through here. Once upon a time, it used to take fucking 40 minutes with Kim behind me. That's <laughs> <laughs> no, that's fair call. It's Just fair call, though. She's behind me now, though. Yeah. Took out that guy, too. And we've had a bloody good run through here today. No traffic coming uh, in front of us. Which is good, isn't it, boat? Yeah. We've had to overtake people along here before. Yeah, yeah. And it's warmer, too. Yeah, it is. Yeah, a lot warmer. Yep. Yeah. Just come through a time warp. Yep. Yeah. Anyway, we'll catch you down the road, guys, because we're out of the pass now. And um, 
we're about mm, 35 k's I think from St Helens aren't we from here welcome to St Helens guys and what a beautiful afternoon we got down here haven't we what my son beautiful July winter's day in the boat all we got to do is find our accommodation for the night it's not our regular accommodation. No, no, no. We'll take you past the regular accommodation that we, we've we come down to for years and years and years, haven't we? Probably three or four times a year. But now, I think they've decided they're going to pull it down and build something else there. But we loved it because of the million dollar views. Looking out across this beautiful harbour here. Bay. Harbour. Bay. We'll call it a bay. Gorgeous <laughs> bay. <laughs> So that there, guys, is the wharf area. Oh, of course, a lot of you have been down here to St Helens with us before, haven't they? See, right there is the wharf. Beautiful little town, this one. So we'll turn right here just to show you our old accommodation, which is the Bayside Inn, that there in front of you. But they had other accommodation out the back, didn't they, babe? Mm-hmm. They've got upstairs there. Oh, it's still here, babe. Yeah, can't live there, though. This is it here on the left, guys. Right there. It is no more, though. They don't rent it out no more. I don't know why. This is the main street, guys. It's just... Is that a lodge on yeah, the right? Art, no, it's called Artner Lodge. Oh, that's Gravity Lodge. Yeah. Where is it? I don't know. We should have gone there. It was 80 bucks. Where? There. The unit's at the rear. That's the one that used to be called Artner's Lodge. Oh, it's called Gravity Lodge. Yeah. I so think that's it, babe. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that's where. Because it used to be called Artner's Lodge. That's what I booked it as, too. Oh. Should we check it out, then? Yep. Yeah, this is it. Office I'm down the back. Uh, we'll back in. Yep, keys in the door. Are you sure it's the right one? Yep, yep, keys in the door. Okay. Yep, number six there, both. Where do we park? Oh, I'm going to back back in here. Okay. <laughs> Let's hope it's the right place. Well, the keys in the door. Yeah, but they, anyone could... I mean, everyone probably does that. Well, they've tricked me. I've booked it as Art in a Lodge. <laughs> what was it, Art? Huh? Yeah, that's what it used to be called. Am I in the lines? Nowhere near it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so this is our boat for the night, guys. Number six right there. Well, we think it is. <laughs> don't we, probably, babe? Probably in somebody else's accommodation. No, well, I don't think we are, babe. Sure. So they got keys in the door there for number four and number yeah, two. Yeah, they probably all do it. No. no. <laughs> Kim's worried we're in the wrong place. <laughs> Trust me. There's somebody else's place. Okay, we're going in. <laughs> I'll find it. Don't worry, sweetie. Seat number six. I'm pretty sure this is it, babe. Oh, God, I hope so. How are you going to know if it is? I'm going Someone's to... in there. What? Anyone in there? No, no one's in here. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll take me head off. No one's in here, babe. Come in, come in, Freddy, come in. <laughs> Quick, we've got a unit for free. Oh, God, we paid for one somewhere. <laughs> okay, guys, so we've made it to... Well, we think this is where we're staying. We booked it under Artnor Lodge and it's called something else, but we're here anyway. So, there's the bikes parked up there for the night. This is the complex right here. I'll show you around the barbecue area soon. I'll take you inside. Young Kimmy's in there somewhere. She's in here somewhere. Hey, what? What the, what? What the fuck are you doing? Well, you said we were going What the hell? You said we were... <laughs> what have you done? What have you done? Yeah. <gasps> what, what the? Yeah, oh my it. fucking god! Yeah. What else have you got? Oh my god! Are you gonna have a ball? 
the time or what? Look at that face! She's brought batteries! We must have come for a week! <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> that wasn't me! God, I, was I tell you! <laughs> babe! I was getting the bag ready to nah, stuff it! That's not right, we've come. I didn't know we're coming for a dirty weekend away. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> the little rusty's in for a bit of fun, don't they? Anyway, this is our room. Yeah, telly on the wall. Old Kim over there, ready to be room. I don't know where you get this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Whoever owns this, please. That's <laughs> lies. That's lies. Wait, wait, There's a the helmet. Give her a little kip on the bum there. <laughs> and this is. The shower. No, Rusty there. <laughs> Look at her playing with the toys over there and the batteries hiding them all. Please take your props back. <laughs> but that's not a bad little unit, is it, eh? So we should be right in here for the night, shouldn't we? Oh, Do well, the nice thing, babe. We'll be fine. Yeah. <laughs> You'll be outside. I'll be here. <laughs> we just got to, I'll probably be over there in that bed yeah. later. <laughs> but we'll go down the street soon. We're going to get some stuff, aren't we? You've got the essentials, haven't we, babe? We've got everything. Yes, we've got everything. We're going around the back here and we're going to our barbecue area, aren't we, babe? I was just thinking, what? Rusty got everything when he got me. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've got visitors. Okay, we're going across the barbecue area. That? That's our cat there, see? Hello. That's our cat. Yeah, look, he talks too, doesn't he? Yeah, so we're going across here and we're going to have a couple of stubbies. Look, I've arranged it for Kim. Maybe I'm proposing to Kim tonight. Look, I've got the can lights and everything, babe. I've already done hey? that. Look. Well, you don't believe it. Look, there's can Isn't lights and everything. Hey? Isn't our wedding night? Oh, look, I've even got soft covers for her sexy little tush. <laughs> look, a candelabra and everything there. She's not too bothered at the moment. She's had two stubbies. She's gone. She's gone. Oh, <laughs> but this oh, look. is. There's even rope here, babe. There's even up. rope. Oh, jeez, that will go down well with them toys, won't it, eh? Up. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we're going to sit back and relax. You're looking after your tush and my tush. For a while. You're not going nowhere near my tush. <laughs> <laughs> Keep that out of your head. And um, we're going to order some tea later. Probably have some pizza and chips, won't we, babe? Because there's a beautiful pizza shop. Beautiful crinkle cut chips down here, aren't they? Mm. So we'll probably go for them. What do you reckon? Right. Did you bring the lighter? Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> yeah, Where's right. the wood? Yeah, we've like got some wood. Yeah, I've just seen we've got a fire pit. Look at that. We're going to make our own pizza, look. Yeah, we've got no nah, bag of making our own. I want people to wait on me, sweetie. Not wait for me. They're or something. No, oh, I don't know. Anyway, we'll catch you later, guys, won't we? Yes. <laughs> See ya. Bye. Bye. We're away for the night, aren't we, babe? Yes. We're at... St. Helens. St. Helens, that's right. Yes, no, I forgot for a sec. You know why I forgot? You know why I forgot? Because we got a fire pit going, haven't we? Yeah, we thought we were home. <laughs> the motel we're at, they lit the fire pit. Look, hey, wait a minute. They've lit the candles and everything. Look, that's wait a minute, up. look. There's our candelabra. And look, there well, more candles there. And... More candles there. It must be... Our cat's over there. Our cat's over there. Yeah, our cat's wandering around. So it must be a special night, mustn't it, babe? What's happening tonight? I don't know. <laughs> what is happening? What's happening? You know, what's happening? Well, I don't need you, apparently. Yeah, no, you don't need me with all the toys mm -hmm. you brought with you, hey? But that's another video, that's isn't another it? another video. <laughs> but look at that. Look at that. I'll tell you what. You want to come down here? Mm -hmm. We're staying at the... Artner Lodge, which used to be the Artner Lodge, didn't it? It Gravity. is now Gravity Isle Lodge in St. Helens. <laughs> Kim's on fire, me. look. Kim's on fire. Me. <laughs> Sparks. But we're at the Gravity Gravity Lodge, isn't it? Gravity Isle Lodge now. See yes. our buses? Yes. And they do a, uh, what do they do? They do um, push bike, trail bike tools, don't yes. they? in trails and everything all around St. Helens area. So anyway, guys, we're going to sit back and have a few more stubbies, aren't we, babe? Mm -hmm. And we're going to enjoy this night because we're about to order pizza and chips, aren't we? We are. Yes, mm -hmm. and we're going to have a ball of time with our fire. Hey, the best thing is, it's free fucking wood, man. It's free wood. <laughs> we can pile it up. What do you reckon, Dazza? <laughs> pile it up, mate. Anyway, we'll catch you later, guys. Bye. Bye. Oh. The 
sun's on the way down. Look at this. The moon is happening. See, look. The moon just got covered. Beautiful day down here, Dave. Oh, yeah, oh no, I'm back, aren't I? <laughs> no, I know, I know. You promised that they were going. Beautiful, going. yeah, I oh, know, but I'll go in a minute. Beautiful ride today, albeit it probably didn't get over 11 degrees till we got to St Helens, where it probably got to 13 or 14, but, you know, when we left home, it's warm, 7 degrees, 8 degrees, 9 degrees. Six, Pulled into six. Canara Junction, mm -hmm. uh, Epping Forest, 9 degrees still. Mm -hmm. Come down the east, St Mary's, still about 8 or 9 degrees. Come across St Mary's Bar, she come up 3 or 4 degrees, didn't it, babe? Yep. Bonza, nice and warm then, beautiful and sunny. Mm -hmm. Hey, guys, I'm going for sure this time. Yep. Hey, guys. Bye.